Hello guys, welcome to Ankit Sunil Vits. Today I'll tell you 12 tips to escape from ragging. Generally, ragging is banned in India, but still in some part of colleges and school, ragging is still going on, which is very, very sad. So I am here to give you 12 ways to escape from ragging based on my almost 8 years of experience uh, with the ragging. Number one advice is if you are very friendly in nature, you can make your seniors as your friend. If you get friendly with your seniors, then it's very, very beneficial for you as seniors will help you a lot during your exams. They will tell you the important questions. They will give you a lot of free treats and canteens and they will even give you advice regarding your exam preparation and tips to survive in college. Second advice is if you know anyone in the same college uh, who is working faculty or who is working in this school or in the college, then you can take advantage of them. You can, while giving your introduction to your senior, you can say uh, this, this person is my relative. Or if your brother or sisters are studying in the same school or college as a senior, then you can tell that in the introduction. Do not skip it because if you tell that person is your brother or your relative, who is working in the same college or institute then senior will get little uh, scared of you and they would be you know little cautious uh, with you while taking a ragging uh, third tip is if you are very good in excuse making then uh, this tip is very very helpful you can always make excuse like i'm having diarrhea i'm having fever not feeling well or i'm uh, feeling homesick or you can you make excuse like uh, some senior have called you or some teacher have called you for some work or you can even say like your parents are visiting today so you are waiting for them or you are going to meet. Fourth tip is uh, you can cry. Uh, if you are crying then uh, most of the seniors who are very emotional they will leave you early. They will uh, make you feel better in instead of dragging you further. But uh, certain time crying may not help you. Uh, the fifth one is which is my favorite one which is being bold. What you can tell is you can scare the senior when he or she is crossing the limit. When they cross the limit, you can say back off, I'm going to report it further. The advantage of it, juniors are considered as minority. So even if junior will lie about uh, his ragging or her ragging, generally the administration will, will believe on junior rather than the senior. So sometimes junior can even misuse this advantage of being minority in the campus. But junior should not take uh, advantage of this fact that uh, they are the minority in the campus. Everyone will trust them more regarding the complaints. So junior should not put a false complaint uh, uh, about his senior regarding ragging because it can damage someone's career, his whole life it can damage. The sixth one is you can make use of your phone call. You can tell your relative or your friend or even your parents uh, at what time to call you. If your senior have called you at particular time for ragging or something, that time you can tell your parents to call you uh, so you will be easily escaped from that situation. The seventh tip is you can become uh, dumb and boring in front of your senior when your senior tell you to sing or dance or to act. That time you can say I do not know or become too boring. That is the best one. If your senior finds you boring, non-entertaining, so they will leave you early. They don't uh, disturb you much. The another tip is if you are friendly with some super senior, so you can use him. You can tell your super senior to tell you are senior uh, to leave you early or not to disturb you much. The 10th tip is you can butter, your, butter up your senior. Most of the seniors like buttering up or getting flattered. So if you are very friendly with them and you know buttering up them always so they will leave you early. Uh, the next tip is you can avoid staying in hostel. Hostel is the main area of you know ragging. So you can avoid staying in hostel. You can even uh, stay outside your campus in a, as a paying guest or you can spend more time in library than the hostel. So uh, you can avoid uh, facing seniors. Uh, the next tip is uh, if your college is very very big like an engineering college thousands of students no one knows uh, each other or much so that time what you can do you can if a senior start ragging you or something just cover up your face and run away that's the best thing you can do because no one can find out who was this who was that guy because the campus is so big lot of students if, so it's good you can run away directly and soon and senior and the best part is senior won't run after you to catch you because it will look so funny you know seniors are catching, running after the juniors now ragging is not that bad at all it makes you a little rough and tough it gives you a little bit of mental stamina but if when it crosses limit you should not sit back 
you should not hide it from your parents or your relatives or or your friends you should take step that time and ragging is is a crime i'm telling you ragging is a crime if you are not comfortable with the ragging you should tell it to your senior so they can leave you and still if if the seniors are crossing limit they are there is physical handling or abuses or you know going in a totally wrong direction and you are very very uncomfortable you must report it to the faculty to the administration do not sit back quietly and ragging is a crime uh, you must understand this is your life you can decide how, what uh, way you want to live your life what to do with your life no one can uh, you know rule over you you can use any of the tips out of these 12 uh, thank you guys for watching this video see you in, guys in my next video bye bye